and how she does it. Well, I hope so. I mean, the people I do it with are people that I have like some degree of relationship with, and I know, know that I hope right. that they know I'm kidding. That's why I wanted to like say. Well, other. that's what I was gonna say for you though. I was thinking people, if you keep doing that, they're gonna and then we hang out like this, they're gonna know that you're just doing that to yeah, me. I know, but you know, I. I I, I wasn't saying I, I care. No, no, That's I think that you're right to a certain extent. I think you're right, but at the same time, like, I don't want to get carried away with it either. It's not cool. Like, you shouldn't have to sit there and listen <laughs> to me do that just because, like, you know, because to make it seem as much. No, no, I really think it's funny. And outside of this, I know. I would think it's funny every single day as much I as know. you do it. I just think other people oh, yeah, will yeah. eventually you pick it up. I watch Dick doing things like that, though, and it's beginning to fucking drive me wild. And uh, I can see that it's beginning to annoy some of the people he's doing it to, and I don't want to be Dick. Uh, but but I think can never annoy me. Well, I think a lot of people are kind of have that same thing. Well, it's like, well, yes, there's a difference. He's like a fucking 44-year-old pervert and a weirdo, and you're actually someone that, like, I'm cool yeah. with and totally done with, and we're just being silly. Right. But I don't want to ever, you know... Joking yeah, I'm saying for me personally. With some of the girls and like have them be like having that reaction. That's what I get I uncomfortable with is when it's fine for you to do it, but sometimes when others do it and then like they're not as close, it gives them a weird reaction. And then people then like they could be confused with why doesn't it bother you when he does it? And then it looks like right. like we're closer. Yeah, no, you can totally be bothered by it. If you want, you can fake slap me. <laughs> I don't know, I just some nights it's like totally easy and some nights it just gets real awkward and uncomfortable like you feel every room you're going into like you're not a part of it all and it's just mm -hmm. fucking nothing to say to someone. I'm just excited for tomorrow. Yeah, I mean... Just out and in my room at the same it's time, it's, it's weird. It's gonna be a lot of... It'll, it'll be really telling about whatever, whatever it's headset also. It'll be interesting to see how many votes Kayla yeah. got, in my opinion. I don't think she's gonna do too well. No, I know, but it'll be interesting because it's going to say nine. I'll show a couple things. Nine, two. Think who's going to be the other one? One of my Kurzak. Because <laughs> why didn't Joe vote? Because he's a fucking liar. I know, but. Oh, that's why. I mean, that's because he's with Dustin. No, he's just a liar. He's just the type of fucking shit. So he thinks he's, he's fucking slicker than he is. He just goes and tells them both that they're going to keep you, and he's just fucking lying. No, I know. Honestly, if anyone ever, ever, and I'm talking ever for one second about any topic, believes a word that's coming out of his mouth, <laughs> they should fucking throw themselves off a bridge. <laughs> I just sit there and listen to it, but it's not a fucking <laughs> sentence of truth. That, that yeah. He's so, I've never in my entire life met <laughs> someone who's so fucking full of shit. Yeah. And, you know, it makes me really happy. And I hope I'm not the one who does it. I hope it's Dustin or someone else. Thanks. Oh my God, he he is going to be so devastated when he goes home early. He's not even going to make a sequester, and he's going to think he has the shit locked up, and it's going to fucking crush him, and it's going to make me so fucking happy. He's such a fucking idiot. He's making an ass of himself. He's making fucking jokes about he's making fucking Dustin too because he doesn't do it. Making jokes about fucking cancer. What the fuck? I mean, who does that? Who thought fucking, that was funny? Even fucking Dick wouldn't make a joke like that. <laughs> That's beyond. I mean, yeah, but right? You don't say that. There's nothing funny about it. And he tells jokes. And he's even the hot dog the night he was telling about John Ramsey now, dressed up as a killer and stuff like that. And it's just, you know, just it's not funny. It's just the stupidest fucking places. And he picks people, gets into fights about political debates and religion. And what Kel said that was very interesting was, she said, Kel talk. Well, very briefly, very briefly, <laughs> and, it still, and it was still very cryptic, yeah. but what she said was, <laughs> what she said was, if you feel a certain way about a certain someone, in all likelihood, there are other people who feel that way too. And I said, eh, you're probably right, you're probably right, they're just not saying it, but they're probably right. I was so fucking pissed at her. Someone, it must have been Dick, but I think I started saying, mentioning this to you, someone must have told her that I was pissed at her and she better oh, fucking yeah, yeah, watch yeah. it because all of a sudden the next day is like, let's be friends again and trying to joke with me and I was like, I none of it at all. Because like, okay, so really, I really actually think Nick was trying to start a thing. I, I know that you think I'm like, 
at the first sight, like on the first. I don't think that's hard to believe at all. No, no, no. So he really was like trying to be like, you know. A